Welcome to Red Earth Native Plants, how to grow New Zealand trees and shrubs. Right, for the seeding. Now I use probably half to three quarters of a tray of good quality potting mix. Then the top quarter or third, I use a good quality seed raising mix. Seed raising mix is finer. A bit sandier. So really good for small seeds because the potting mix tends to be quite coarse. You don't want the seed getting lost amongst it. Okay just about fill it up with the seed raising mix and we're ready to put our seed in. Now it'd be so easy just to broadcast the seeds over the mix and cover it over and see what we get out of that. And if I was growing tens of thousands of kauri, I probably would. But because I'm pretty keen to see what sort of germination rate I'm getting, I'm going to plant them in rows. And then I'll know how many seeds I plant and how many seeds come up. Give them a bit of space, but I usually probably do seven this way. Eight rows of seven, seven rows of eight. You notice I'm not pressing it down too far into the soil. Ideally, seeds shouldn't be planted more than twice their thickness. Oh, just plant the last row of this tray. So now I've done that, I'm going to cover it with some more seed raising mix, not too heavily. and firm it down. That's really just to keep the seeds in place because when it's watered you don't want the seed all sloshing around. Okay, so we've tamped it down, we've got the seeds in place. Put a label in so we know what date we planted them. Now I can do the rest. <laughs> 